Welcome to Mindly Way, where we explore life philosophies to grow and find the right path. Get ready to listen for an inner journey. Despite my constant preaching to the contrary, realize that this is all a mirage and do not become engrossed in it. Channel to avoid becoming lost in the outside illusion and to believe in your inner divinity. In fact, I do tend to get lost in it. The human experience in this 3D world is as such as even Neville Goddard whom I deeply respect for the wonderful redeeming work he has shared with us forgot to apply the law of assumption in a particular problem, yes even Neville Goddard found himself lost in the drama of life when he wanted to seek divorce from his first wife as he wanted to marry his true love, he forgot to apply the law and started to think how he could get a divorce as he wasn't on good terms with his first wife but then he remembered that he is the operand power and everybody is him pushed out which is the point of this video to help you remember that you are living in a holographic and interactive illusion and I am guilty of getting lost in it recently I would like to apologize to my dear audience for not being consistent with uploads on the channel but big changes have been happening in my life like moving to another country where I have wanted to go for a long time the home country of my wife the girl I wanted to have and apply the law together effortlessly many blessings have followed in terms of fulfillment of my goals and my life is shaping more so each day the way I wanted to but since many of my goals have been achieved I once again find myself lost in the illusion as burning desires make us go inward and we find our ourselves deeply focused on the law to achieve what we want but if the burning desire has been achieved you find yourself in a complacent old way of being that is focused on the outer world despite especially in this day and age of social media and all the craziness that is going on in this dramatic world wars and bad news is in your face and you can't avoid it therefore I found myself getting lost in the rabbi hole of these ongoing conflicts and why they are happening who is benefiting from them which leads you to some very familiar perpetrators same faces and cults keep appearing I may make a video about it if you guys would like but the point of this video is to bring back the focus on you why you are here and what is your purpose as focusing on the outer world kind of replaces it with the old concept of God for example if you believe your government holds all power and rules your life you are replacing it with God you are giving them all the power if you think elites are doing it you are giving them all the power out locus of control losing yourself in the illusion this is why i am hesitant to make videos about these characters of this illusion who are dealing with the masses in an unfair way as this video and my channel are about bringing back your power to you inner locus of control you see this is the experience of your soul the soul has certain plans and desires that it wants to experience in this life but the mind overtakes the experience with the identity of a human therefore it doesn't see how it is going to accomplish the desires of the soul as the mind is always focused on the outer world and circumstances it believes in separation it believes in the solidity of this world and thinks that it is limited control over things therefore the mind feels helpless and gives up it's like you play a game and you are controlling a character but that character gets a will of its own and no longer follows your instructions and gives up in the game as it doesn't have the vision that you have but it's not its game you are the real player not the character stop identifying with a character the mind is just a tool for you to traverse through choices only via the lens of the mind that is outer locus of control making decision based on what you interpret from this illusion you will have a bad experience you will not be satisfied to say the least because you're ignoring the desires of the real you the inner man as Neville Goddard likes to call it there's soul is one with the all so everything that you wanted already has it wants to experience it from the perspective of a human living in a 3d world and it is always focused inwards it doesn't really factor in the outside conditions because it exists outside of the system of time and space it knows no time or space it is our greater immortal or spiritual self no matter which spirituality book i pick up there is always the concept of this higher self you cannot escape it they just use different ges to refer to the same thing always painting the picture of this world being an illusion or a sort of a game an experience of the soul you want is already present in the all and your soul is wanting to experience that desire in this garment of flesh that is you but the only obstacle between your higher self and the desire is your smaller self the mind of man because the mind of man is grounded in the outer locus of control it believes more in the out there than in here the out there doesn't really exist in the sense that your mind believes it to be some of this illusion is just background to make this experience more authentic yet the mind gets lost in the background details like if the democrats when i will have a good life they will do right by me and help me fulfill my desires so he is giving the power into the hands of the democrats or the republicans who in reality don't matter in your life they are not important to your soul's experience doesn't need the government's help to fulfill its desires it has all the power but since you are focused on the outer locus of control way of being the outer must drive your experience making it your god or the almighty power that rules over you suppressing your real self hence having a less than satisfactory experience is what you get therefore the joy of life is sucked out of you all you need to do is bring back the control inwards look within listen to your higher self 
trust it to get things done for you and do not get lost in the background details of this life. Do not give power to anybody outside of you as by doing so you will appoint them as your savior and they might disappoint you. Your soul has ways you know not of. If it needs someone outside of you to play a role to get you what you want at will it is not the concern of. The mind to figure out all the details, but if the mind attaches too much importance on the outside characters, those outside characters will have the power then and they may behave unexpectedly as your mind mind is never consistent, it might have attached some hope, some despair and some untrustworthiness to these characters, consequently you live a life of chaos and unpredictability, turn back to the only real source of power, your higher self as Jesus said I am my father are one but my father is greater than I, what does that mean? It means that you can experience things that are beyond your imagination, and if you allow it, it will enable you to fully enjoy this life because it is one with everything that exists. All you need to do is get to know yourself, your true self, and avoid losing yourself in the meaningless details of this world or in the delusion that everything is within you. So awaken, O oh mortal, and reclaim your life.